Hi, I'm Lang Is, and today we're introducing the latest features of MSI Creator Z16P and Z17, and also how to use it. The Creator Z17 and Creator Z16P are the latest high-performance portable laptops specifically designed for professional content creators. Also, it is meta-ready for you to create any metaverse content. By the way, MSI also launched a new, refreshed version of Creator Z16 as well, so please check MSI website for more information. The Creator Z17 and Z16P both have stylish CNC body with their unique lunar gray color. The large touchpad allows users to move cursor to their destination at once. The kit design in front of the touchpad also makes the laptop display easier to be lifted. The Creator Z17 and Z16P have up to 12th Gen Core Intel i9 processor with 14 cores. It brings evolutionary hybrid core architecture, consists of both performance core and efficient core. Also, the laptops are equipped with up to NVIDIA RTX 3080 Ti graphics processor with 16 GB GDDR6 VRAM. The accuracy of color is always crucial to content creators. The 16x10 true pixel display of Creator Z17 and Z16P have Delta Less 2 color accuracy and 100% DCI-P3. Moreover, they both have touchscreen that supports MSI Pen, which provides you a new way of creating your own product. The Creator Z17 and Z16P have two M.2 SSD slots. That means you don't have to be limited to the internal hard drive size anymore. The Creator Z17 and Z16P have the I.O. ports that a creator needs. Let's take a look at the Creator Z17 first. On the left-hand side, there's DC in for adapter, two Thunderbolt 4, note that the rear one supports PD charging, then an audio combo jack, and on the right side, there's an HDMI port, a USB 3.2 Gen 2 Type A port, and an SD card reader. I know you can't wait to turn on this beautiful laptop. Just a reminder, before turning it on, if you have just unboxed the laptop, please connect the adapter to the laptop first. It disables the factory shipping mode, which prevents power being turned on accidentally during product transportation. Also, there's a chance that the fans might become louder when you first connect to internet. This is due to the automatic Windows update, and the fan will be quiet again once the update is done. Press the power button to turn on the laptop. The power button of Creator Z17 and Z16P was designed to prevent user from pressing it unintentionally. When you press the power button, it does not go straight to sleep or shut down like the other regular laptops. Instead, press and hold for one second, then release to trigger sleep. Four seconds for shutdown option. The Thunderbolt 4 port is almost an all-in-one port. You can transmit data to another computer using Thunderbolt cable, plug in USB devices, and even charge the laptop. In case you forgot to bring the adapter along, MSI recommend using Power Delivery Standard Compatible Charger that is more than 65 watts. If your mobile device supports PD charging, the Thunderbolt 4 port will initiate PD output. The IR camera and fingerprint sensor on Creator Z17 and Z16P both support Windows Hello, which means biometric login. During the Windows 11 account setup, you can register both fingerprint and face login together with the PIN code. If you skipped and would like to register later, you can go to Windows Setting, Accounts, then Sign In Options to complete the registration. With the help of modern standby, you can unlock and log in by just tapping your finger without hitting the power button key first, or open the lid of laptop and log in instantly. By default, the MSI keyboard hotkeys will perform the printed functions in one touch, while holding function key performs the typical functions. However, if you prefer those roles reversed, simply hold Fn plus escape, and you will know it's reversed with the LED indicator. The numpad on the keyboard can be toggled on and off by pressing the number lock key. When number lock is on, the LED indicator will light up and the number pad will output numbers. When it is off, it will output arrow or page up, down, home, and end. The Creator Z17 and Z16P 16x10 display have extra 11% space comparing to regular 16x9 panel. It reduces the chance of scrolling. 
Moreover, it is a touch screen that you can interact with the content directly without waiting for the cursor to move to the target object. The touch screen can be controlled with your fingertip and MSI pen. They are very useful while using software like Lightroom with many adjustable bars. In Windows 11, you can drag window to the left or right edge for multitasking scenario. You can also adjust the size proposition by scrolling the separation line in the middle. If you need mouse right-click function, tap and hold with your finger on the screen. The touchscreen also supports multi-finger gesture. You can use two fingers to zoom in and out in different software. By swiping from the left of screen, you can call up the widget. From the right, you can call up Notification and Control Center. If you swipe up with three or four fingers, it will list all of the windows you have and also you can add a new desktop here. If you add a new desktop, swipe left or right with four fingers to switch between desktops. You can also swipe down with three or four fingers to minimize all windows. If you wish to turn off touch function temporarily, for example, you want to discuss your work on the screen with your client but don't want to be interrupted by the touch function, open Device Manager, select Human Interface Devices, right-click on HID-compliant touchscreen, and select Disable. If you wish to turn it on, just follow the same procedure and enable it. The MSI Pen supports MPP 2.0 protocol, so it can be used on any laptop that supports it, such as MSI Summit Series or even other laptop brands. What makes it stand out among the others in the market is that it's not only a stylus with 4096 level pressure sensitivity, but also a Bluetooth remote presentation controller. To pair the MSI Pen to the laptop with Bluetooth, open Bluetooth settings. Click Add Bluetooth Device. Then hold the MSI Pen Bluetooth button. Click the MSI Pen on the screen and complete the pairing. To know the detailed tips of using it as a stylus and a remote controller, please check our MSI Pen tutorial video. When you are moving to other places with lid closed, same as Summit Series, Creator Z17 and Z16P also has built-in magnet that can hold the MSI Pen. The display of Creator Z17 and Z16P are calibrated by True Color technology to maintain its color accuracy. You can change the color setting if you wish to, open True Color app, choose the color profile, and if you extend it, you can adjust the detail parameter. To maintain the powerful CPU and GPU working at their best, a suitable cooling system is mandatory to keep the temperatures low. The Creator Z16P has the state-of-the-art cooling system, the Vapor Chamber Cooler. Its cooling ability can even outperform regular heat pipe cooling systems. In case of heavy-duty software workload, you can always go to MSI Center and turn on Cooler Boost function to maximize the airflow. We have another video explaining about how Vapor Chamber works and how amazing it is, so please check our MSI channel. Sometimes you may forget the hotkey of your Creator software. The per-key RGB keyboard on Creator Z17 and Z16P can definitely solve your problem. In SteelSeries engine software, you can customize the color of the key with corresponding software. For example, by choosing Illumination and clicking X, you can change the color of single key. The Creator Z17 Thunderbolt 4 port can also become a display output port. With the USB Type-C and HDMI port, you can connect three extra monitors for better multitasking efficiency. For Creator Z16P, Although it has no HDMI port, you can still achieve multi-display through daisy chain setup. Here's how to set up the monitors. After connecting them, press Windows plus P or F11 and switch to Extend mode. Go to Display setting to adjust the monitor position and this is all it takes to have four monitors working simultaneously. There are different scenarios in MSI Center. Just like gears in your car, you can shift to the best one that suits your needs. You can change them in MSI Center or by pressing the hotkey with FN key. Now, MSI has launched a brand new function called Smart Auto. Smart Auto will justify your laptop workload and status. Then, it will change to the most appropriate user scenario. That means you no longer have to toggle between different scenarios. There's also another brand new function called the Ambient Silent AI. 
it redefines what silent means in a relative way. The background noise you hear in a coffee shop and office is different. In a coffee shop, the background noise can be above 45 decibel, whereas office noise can be just as high as 30 decibel. Ambient Silent AI will actively detect the surrounding noise level and rise fan speed accordingly. Remember to update your MSI Center to the latest version to gain those functions. We created dedicated videos to explain about these features. So again, stay tuned with us. Hope the introduction today is useful and thank you for watching. See ya. Nine percent. Okay, I messed up there. I'm sorry. Three. <laughs> Moreover, <laughs> and on the wrong side. Down, <laughs> you have. Sorry. Dot two SSD slots. That means you don't have to be a limit. <laughs> okay.